my name is Kate Richardson and I am currently living in Vancouver. My experience this week has been unbelievable. Um, transcendental, I don't even know the word to describe it. I think um, it's just been, it's been a complete uh, transformation of my physical self on stage. Um, I guess the first few days I was sort of just rolling with it and uh, trying to figure out what was happening and, and just immersing myself in the experience and meeting lots of people and thinking that really fun, lots of things to learn. But the last few days I just had a huge, huge breakthrough in my physical experience on stage and, uh, and also just recording and getting my raw vocal out there rather than um, just like a show. So I was actually really connecting finally with my song which was fantastic because I've never really done that. I th always thought I was connecting, but I was really just singing the song rather than actually performing what the words really mean. So Stephen was um, just unbelievable in helping me to break through what it is to actually feel that, including going like this in the booth at me when I was trying to, <laughs> when I was trying to sing the song. And I was trying to do this take. It was unbelievable. I was trying to do this take. And it was, it was being sung all nicely and I was on pitch and everything. And then he's like, right, slams the door, gets into the booth and says, I'm gonna stand right here. And no kidding, he was, he was a foot away from me, right here, and he was doing this. <laughs> like this, I'm thinking, oh my God. I, but every time he did that, I just slipped into this different person. And it was like, wow, there it is. My toughest moment was probably was probably realizing that, um, you know, it really, it, it, it just isn't, even though I knew this, it was really hearing it from, from the big Jesus, was that you really need to have everything prepared. You can't just be a, a good singer. I mean, for me, I've always just got by on having a big voice. But it was tough because, you know, I have my song absolutely brutalized <laughs> and chopped apart and, and changed. and. It was a really tough moment because I totally had to let go of something I'd written and it had sort of part been part written for a while and I was so attached to it. So it was it was tough to then have that broken down and be told that's not how to write a really winning song. Um, but the flip side of that was by the end of it, when I'd rewritten it, everyone was just, wow, it's 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 totally transformed. It's it's a phenomenal song that's gone from being this and I I'm one of these people that I figure once it's broken, it's broken, chuck it away. But I guess what I learned from the craft of rewriting music was you can actually make something that really wasn't very good into something that was really pretty good. Light was definitely um, when I was on stage doing my rehearsal and um, Stephen um, basically grabbed my hand and said this is how you are going to perform this song and I just I was nearly in tears I honestly was in tears I felt myself start to cry and I'm like don't cry don't cry don't cry but I, I came off stage and I just thought that was what I came for I want to cry now <laughs> don't cry on stage don't cry on camera but it was really a just moment where I just thought this is what I came to do this program for and this is what um, Stephen and I talked about on Skype before I even got here, was that this is the change I needed. So it's huge. Highlight for sure. <laughs> My advice for people doing the program would definitely be, um, if you haven't already got some knowledge about understanding chords and uh, chord chart and a little bit of music structure, is just to do a little bit of homework before you come. I had no idea, I'm not a musician, so, well I'm a musician but I, I don't play an instrument. So my advice would be really read up on that, really start to understand, at least understand where your song came from, if you've got some music. Um, have a little bit of an idea about uh, the type of person you are and, and who you want to be and who you can see yourself in LA as being. Um, and just, just really be prepared to be open. That's the biggest thing, I think. Really allow yourself to be changed in whatever way it's gonna be when you're here, because you will be, guaranteed, by the end of the week. It's a different person that walks out of here.